Killing the boss sure was rough. After coming to question my loyalty to the US, I decided to retire from Fox. It's a good thing that now I can take some time off to get my thoughts in order. <laughs> hey, you're big boss. Uh, actually, you can just call me. Get over here. Okay! Hey, Fox unit's new sneaking suit, and it's just my size! Okay, so. What? I'm not Colonel Roy Campbell. Fox is gonna do something involving nuclear missiles and probably Russians. Snake, get out there. Okay! Time to call someone in. Yeah, exactly. Snake! The military thinks you and Major Zero did some crazy terrorist stuff. What? Happy mission! Hey, so did you call someone to help us out? Uh, about that. Uh, apparently the US government thinks I'm leading the Fox Rebellion. And they're kinda not gonna let me back in the country unless I prove I'm not. So I, uh, Kinda sort of need your help. Sorry, my leg's broken and I've got malaria. Oh, well, you can drive me around. But, but my leg's broken. You don't need legs to drive. Okay, time to kidnap a dude. Well, hey, do you want to join our club? Uh, do you, you want, want to join, join our club? club? No way, I can't do but trade us. And Gene is an awesome dude who loves justice, so we- Oh, I'm sorry. I thought I just heard the sound of the boss rolling in her grave. Okay, we'll join. Snake, you gotta fix this malaria. Yeah, okay. Is that G? Now, now, soldiers. I know you must be feeling discouraged, but as soon as you finish building this facility, we're all going out for Sundays! <laughs> Time to get some stuff. Hey! What the? What are you like, 12? I'm in charge. Hey, wait. You're the girl I saw with Jean in that cutscene. Now I'm gonna grab your shirt like a creepy old man. Eee! I'm Elisa. The girl you saw was my sister, Ursula. We have psychic powers. This is where we keep our perfect soldier. Trademark. Don't fight him. You're totally gonna lose. And here's the cure for your friend's malaria. Hey, how'd you know I was looking for that? Okay, okay, I get it. Snake, you must destroy my sister. Uh. You must do it. Time to listen to some crazy guy in a jail cell. Snake, you have to blow up some stuff. Roger! So I guess I can just- Freeze! Snake! Time to put your plans on ice. So freeze to meet you again, Snake. It's just like cold tides. Better chill out when you deal with this cold customer, or else you'll get freezer burn. Cause I'm no bark on frostbite. You're on thin ice, so freeze the frame and oh my face, my face, my face! Time to perfect soldier. Whoop whoop whoop! Uh. <laughs> Why don't you die? I'm the perfect soldier. <laughs> Why are we doing this again? <laughs> Hello, Snake. We decided to take off all your clothes to make for an awkward moment when Elisa comes in to give you information. But anyway, my voice has magical powers because I'm a successor to the boss, which makes us... Brothers! How does that even kind of make sense? Now I'm going to make an awesome world where soldiers always have stuff to do. Okay, time to... Ah! Oh, what now? Jeez! I'm the guy who did die and I'm the free soldier no, and it's not fair! And I tried to step over my knife, no. but I couldn't hit him! No, I stop! Why. It's not no, fair! You're you're I have to meet this guy! It's not fair! Why can't I meet him? I have to do it! No, shut up! No one cares! Can I see the prisoner? I brought some food. Uh, well... I'm so scared and lonely, and I need a big, strong man to talk to. Uh, Miss Alyssa, I really don't see how that has anything to do with- Just let me in! Okay, I'm sorry. Hey, Snake. I brought you some- Well, uh, thanks for the food. What? I am speaking into your brain. Please, please stop. Well, enjoy your dinner. Take care of Metal Gear, okay? Uh, hey, boss, are you okay? You guys, I know where Metal Gear is, so it's time to put some clothes on. <laughs> oh, what the? <laughs> where is the philosopher's <laughs> legacy? I don't know. Yes, you do. Shut up. <laughs> no, stop it, stop it, stop it. <laughs> Hop on in!
Boy, am I glad we made it out of that one. By the way, Snake, how'd you manage to get a dame like that? Mm. I mean, I like him pretty young too, but isn't she kind of pushing it? Mm -hmm. Give her a couple years and she'll be pretty hot, but... <laughs> well, I'll leave you two lovebirds alone. Hey, wanna hear how my parents were killed? Was it a nuclear explosion? It was a nuclear explosion. When my parents died in the accident, Ursula and I suffered the after effects. Psychic powers. Uh, you know, I've been looking like three nuclear explosions, and I'm pretty sure they don't give you magical powers. Let's talk about babies. I may not be able to have my own, but I know you'll make a great father someday. Say what? Dad, guess what? I learned my sixth language today. Good work, son. You made your father proud. Yeah. Father. I learned my seventh language today. Get out. Solidus, where's my dinner? Coming, Dad. Okay, time to find Metal Gear. Oh, is that it? Hello, everyone. Wait, what the? Was there any more things I met? No. Oh, well, that's cool. I just kind of thought I'd ask. Okay, Gene, give it up. Boy, this sure is a pretty boring ending, huh? Someone wants a totally unnecessary boss fight. Oh, boy. Do you ever notice how Elisa and Ursula are never in the same room together? Oh, no, you didn't. Ursula, I choose you. <laughs> I will now use the phrase accursed snake children in a sentence. This Metal Gear may be pretty goofy looking, but dear Ursula more than makes up for- Elisa, I'm sorry. I'm okay! Okay, Gene, I destroyed your Metal Gear! You destroyed my Metal Gear? I destroyed your Metal Gear! Uh, right? No! Back in action! Sokolov! That Metal Gear was a test model! What? Well, I wanted to say that. Gene, you may have rescued me once, but- I won't allow you to launch a nuclear attack against the motherland! But you helped the US build Metal Gear. Oh, yeah! Wait, Gene! First person to start shooting at random gets a cupcake! <laughs> Is it really what it takes to get some screen time? Whatever. Hey, cheer up, Snake. That guy was a chump. You! Uh, why can't I kill you? I'm the best soldier ever! Thanks for saving me, Big Boss. I love you. Yeah, time to destroy Metal Gear, whatever. Yep. <laughs> Is this going to be one of those cutscenes where I get a five minute explanation of how I got duped by the US military? <laughs> but I'm already Big Boss. <laughs> Time to end this! Yoo-hoo! Oh, never mind the dead researchers on the floor. <laughs> they just went crazy when I told them the gun shoot. <laughs> Pudding. Hey, check this out. Connie was a loser, and I'm going to fire a nuke at the Pentagon. Then I'm gonna make an awesome military nation and call it... <laughs> Army 7! Mm. No! Nobody's gonna join your dumb club, G! What soldiers are looking for is outside your heaven! Hey, that's pretty catchy! Outside heaven? I don't know. I'm just saying. Oh, by the way, Operation Snake Eater was all set up by one guy. Huh? <laughs> Wait, what? Who? I'm not telling! <laughs> what? Okie dokie, time to launch the space. Oh, what? You're killing the trees! <laughs> Elisa, are you okay? The rest of your life will be even more screwed up. Huh? Elisa? Uh, Elisa? Stop, Gene. It's too late, Snake. Metal Gear's in launch mode. But hey, let's fight anyway. We'll find out who the mm, true successor is. I will paint you with you too. Yes, s some money, so you can make your own nation of soldiers. Like that would happen. 
circle off. How do I destroy Metal Gear? You don't. You're screwed, Snake. Oh, well, then we're done, I guess. Hello, everyone. Notice anything awesome and manly? No. Whoops. Big Boss, you saved the world. What are you gonna do now? Sit in my room and mope, but I realized something. Oh, what's that? I'm not alive unless I'm in battle, so I need to find an excuse to fight all the time. That's pretty crazy. I know. How about I make an awesome nation for soldiers so they never run out of cool stuff to do? That's exactly what you stopped Gene from doing. It'll be cooler when I do it. I mean, what could go wrong? Huh? Uh? Uh? Alone. 